Truckers XTV on air. We are now live in three, two, one. All right, welcome back to another exciting episode of Fire Fantasy 7 Remake. In the previous episode, we completed Chapter 8. Today's episode right now, we're going to go into Chapter 9. Aerith has joined the party. You can we see are the running sky. We are running away with her. Sky! I don't like this part of Midgar. Excuse Back me. When they were still building Midgar, there was an accident, and the plate fell. People had only just started moving in, so there weren't a lot living there at the time. Well, whatever freaking monsters we'll encounter, we'll encounter. We saw some rats. Probably encounter those freaking porcupine guys again. We're a 600 meter. What the heck is that? Chinatown? And that's? The underside of Sector 6, Wall Market. A real special place. But I'm sure you already knew that, right? I didn't tell you. I enlisted. Pretty much right after I left home. Don't know much about this place, or any of the slums. Well, it took a lot of people to build Midgar, and they all needed to blow off steam. So some traders built an entertainment district. Inns, shops, bars, the works. Folks started pouring in from all over. Business was booming, money was flowing, which attracted the attention of some guys who didn't much care for the law. Now there isn't any. Right. But instead of trying to solve the problem, the government decided to just wall it in. And that's how Wall Market began. Out of sight, out of mind, as the old saying goes. For the folks in charge, there's no better way to deal with it. So it's like a giant veil. Yeah. Wanna see what's behind it? Not really. <laughs> that's good. Because I know a better way to get to Sector 7. One that, tragically, doesn't go through Wall Market. And it's just through this tunnel here. At least it was, back when I was a kid. Do you not see the sign that says warning? Monsters are up ahead. And now, we're just gonna cruise on by and we're gonna encounter our first few monster scrimmage. In a bit. I bet we're gonna deal with those model drives because this look like this is their turf. Oh, never mind. Look at the scenery. You see the moon, the lighting, rats, again, a broken pipe, whatever this place is. You wanna give me a brief explanation except all this quietness, Aerith? By all means. Crawl, crawl, crawl. Oh, heck no. What's up here? Sector 6 slums, Collapse Expressway. It's been like this, you know, ever since the plate fell. And there's no other way? It'll be an adventure. 600 meters away, here we go. Oh, what the heck? What's with this muse? Ah, oh, it's you again. Assess the, the seahorse. Now we have Blizzard equipped. Hold up, hold up. Okay, okay, I'm dealing with- I'm liking this music. Blizzard! Okay, that did nothing. Okay, anytime now, Chief. Dude, we countered this thing before. And yet, he didn't want to. Okay. Thank you. Level up. Pray material improve. Oh my god. We encountered this thing before, and yet. Oh my. I don't want to talk about it. What the heck are you? I've got so, this. The lesser Drake. <laughs> Heck are you? Assess, please. Oh, we're hitting them with wind attacks, mix them to the staggering while letting magic bring them to the ground in a short time. Gotcha. 
Throw it up. Burn. Time to burn. What happened to you, Arif? Hold up. Going in. Thank you. And we're safe. Fair, deal with those guys in a bit. Get the wind material back. What What's the heck that? is that? A big arm. Kinda cute, don't you think? Uh oh. Let me scoop that up. Moogle metal, let's go. I wanna be surprised oh wait, we're gonna use that thing, aren't we? Take the shortcut. Oh great. Someone's pulled up the ladder. I wonder if we can use this. Okay. Raise the arm, lower arm. Got it. Have a wreath to climb on. For safety, only load or unload the arms within the yellow mark. It's this way. Oh, we bring her down there. Here's an idea. I'll hop on and. Yeah, 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 yeah. Absolutely. I'll throw down the ladder for you to climb. Go, 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 go. Raise it. Go for it. Gotcha. I see you now. Drop her off. Piece of cake. Give me a sec. And here comes the ladder. Well, what did I tell ya? I mean, we'd have been better off if we, got, we took the longer route, but uh, don't mind me. You did it. Yeah. <laughs> uh. Hmm. All right, good enough. Let's keep on trucking. Hmm. She's full of pep, isn't she? Stop. Did we wake it up? Great, you again. Wait a minute, aren't you weak to electric or something? Fire, please? Uh, who has electric? No one. Great. You're all right. Whoa, whoa, whoa. If only we had the thing, but we don't. Okay, I hear some freaking no music going on. Ow, 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 ow. Here it comes. Whoa, whoa, whoa! There we go. About time. Thank you. Used to be away. 
I wonder if someone blocked it off because of all the monsters that kept showing up. Pretty dangerous place for kids to play. Raised in the slums, remember? You're tough. Hmm, that's supposed to be a compliment. Let's find another way. Now we need freaking electric ones. We'll see. If we encounter another one, we'll equip the elect materia. For now, I'm just gonna keep assess. Coming in. Yo, you can hardly see a thing through here. Where the heck are we going? Okay. Going up. What the heck is up there? Just in case, in case, in case. Just in case. I'm hearing some noise. Speaking of noise! Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. I did nothing. Thank you. Keep up with the potions. Like I heard something, I'm like, what the heck is going on behind us? And then that thing appears. Okay, 400 meters away. Let's keep on going. That's not even the right way. I don't know where the heck I was trying to go. I'm about to say. Speak of the devils. These guys were weak to that one thing. Oh, uh, we have that. We can have this. Let me heal up. No? Okay, let's keep on running. I don't like these guys. The moment I saw him, I'm like, no thank you, Chief. Looks like a dead end. Oh shit, sure. the moment we find a dead end, those guys gonna wake up. Watch. Can we just climb up? Looks like there's a way it sh Okay, I see ya. So we go back up. We're gonna fight those guys. Speak of those guys! A fire butt. Let's do it. Oh, I forgot about that guy. Yikes. That was really on me. Those guys were such a problem back in Chapter 8, but now we can beat it up thoroughly. All right, here we go again with this mechanic. Hey, you know I what to you do. Can grab that container. So we're going to grab the container. Oh, 
Oh, I see. We're gonna put in that road right there. Not half bad. So do you moonlight as a crane operator or something? Yeah? Do it. Well, this is awkward. Oh no, look. Why is it always gotta be so tough? Lucky for me, you'll make this easier. Lucky for yes, you, man. we're here in this we're in this mess anyways. Well then, I'm gonna head down. The container. Off for the ride, and here we go. Can you go any slower? Going up. I think we can do it. Drop off. There's two items you can attain. Nope. Hey, do me a favor and get that. Get that for me, yeah? Hmm. Hold on a second. Yes, do it. Binding materia. Gotcha. It's probably something we could have gone back with with Poindexter over there. Huh. If it shows me that message again, I wouldn't be surprised. It's a simple oh, yeah. concept for just just to do a reaction out of that one. Just jump off and all that stuff. What's over here? Are we given that? Oh, not too fast, okay? Got it. What the heck is this? Looks like some other direction. I wouldn't be surprised that if she leads us, we couldn't proceed. So I just want to check what's all this. Uh, eeny, meeny, money, mo. I'm just gonna go through here. Yeah, straight up. I wouldn't be surprised if the dead end up there, and we took the we take this detour. So this is just a big old surprise. If that that's the case. But I wouldn't mind if there's some treasure up ahead. If that wasn't the case. Hey, 300 meters to go. Anybody around? Guess it's just us. Mm. It's still warm. Should we relight it? Have our own campfire? I need to get back. Besides... Looky here, boys! Caught us some burglars! Coming into our homes and stealing our shit! Doing crimes! <laughs> I'd say we're owed compensatory damages! <laughs> Cap a minute! A composite! I don't get it! Ah. How stupid can you be? It's crazy simple. <laughs> Compensatory damages is like, uh, it's like compensation for damages. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's what you get when you, no, when somebody else. We uh, haven't done anything wrong. Yeah, we were just passing through. Oh, like 
ugly story. Uh, okay, what do you want? Nothing but our two recompense, that's all. <laughs> two recompense, two recompense, two. Two recompense? No shit for brains, two recompense. It's like, uh, it's like, uh, Compensatory damages! Damages recompense! I think we've heard enough. These guys have no idea what the heck they're talking about. Back. Oh, no, no point of assessing. We'll just beat the heck out of these guys. No way. I'll take care of them. Dubstep time! Thunder! Beyond the dead end. Okay, guys, whatever you do, don't move. Whatever you guys got, you better have something. So, yeah, I'm assuming that by the time we got there, it was a dead end. So, we have no choice but to go through here. I wouldn't be surprised that we may encounter them again later on as we progress. For whatever the heck the reason they are, I have no idea who the heck they are affiliated with. Shit! Let's get the hell out of here! Who are you guys? Don't leave me! I'm coming! Whatever. Got no time for small fry. What's with this big old vault? Random question, but why did you quit being a soldier? That is random. You don't have to tell me if you don't want to. Um. Did you have any soldier friends? Any war buddies? No. Not really. Oh, okay. Who's next? More of these punks. Put up, put up, put up. Huh? What we got? Fresh resident Oh, what the heck? So it's my turn? Tagging out. Stay strong, okay? I'm coming. So it's so my turn? Can you take over for me? Right, these guys steal. That's just great. We lost 66 kills with those guys. Phoenix down. Still up for it. Beat him up! Thank you. Another one over there? Great. Scoop that up, gotcha. There's two now. Stupid ladders, always out of reach. Okay, Cloud, heading down. You're in charge of the arm. Got it? 
Does it matter which one we're controlling? Oh, gotcha. Down. Bring that up. We'll have her. We'll have her scoop up that materia. hit something, isn't it? Nope. Hello. Okay, go pick it up over there. Magnify gotcha. materia. <laughs> okay, my question is I think I know what to do. This better be the last one. I don't want to deal another. Get over here. Thanks for the lift. I'll have that ladder down for you in a sec. All right, all right. This better be the last one. Square Enix and their puzzle games, I swear. Working together again. Anything to scoop up while we're at it? Nope. Here we go again. Double high five. That went pretty well. Sure did. <laughs> huh? Wait a minute. Did you just? Nope. Do it, boy! Don't worry, we'll be on the same page next time. What are you talking about? I'm sorry, okay? Who wants to get clap? Hold it right there, mother! <laughs> you wanna pass through our territory? Then you gotta pay the toy! I'll take care of them. You gotta be kidding me! Nope, 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 no, 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 no. I am not gonna fall for that dumb trick again. I'm not gonna lose 565 gills for these dumb bandits again. I'm not gonna fall for that dumb trick yet again. So give me that point. Right now, I am not falling for that dumb trick. Through our territory, then you gotta pay the toll. Again? Nope. 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 No. 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 I am not dealing with this every time. I am not dealing with it. Hold it right there, 
lovebirds. Go on. You want to pass through our territory, then you gotta pay the toll. Come on. Get out of here. Thank you. We made it. Smell the fresh air? Yeah, we say goodbye to those bandits. I was not gonna have freaking 565 gil taken away from me. Let's go. Hello? Hold it. Why do we need to hold it? Come on now. <laughs> Great, we're out of here. Let's move on out. What the heck is this place? All right, there it is. The gate to Sector 7. Looks shut. How do we open it? More importantly, how about we take a break? Sound good? No, I don't have time Up for- Up there looks nice. <sighs> Come on. <sighs> huh. <sighs> you know, a long time ago, I used to sell flowers here. Oh yeah? So, Cloud, you were a soldier first class, right? Yeah. Weird. Really? What's weird about it? Nothing. Just that you were the same rank. Huh? As who? The first guy I ever loved. <sighs> What's his name? I probably know him. Are you okay? Wow. Your eyes. Oh. It's because of the Mako. All soldiers have them. Yeah, I know. Sorry, I'm bumming you out. We should go. <sighs> Gotta look forward, not back. So we found a way to like make a shortcut through from five to seven by passing six. Why do I feel like someone's gonna be attacking us in a bit? Why are we walking so slow? Come on now. What are we doing here? The gate's right there. Here. Hmm. This won't take long. <sighs> Want to get to Sector 7 in style? This is the passageway for you. So... <laughs> Go ahead. You gonna be okay getting home? And if I said I wasn't? I'll go with you. I thought you needed to get back. 
don't worry. I have a backup route for emergencies, and it's safer, too. <laughs> Just stay at our place, goddammit. Guess this is it, then. Ready? No. Aw, you big softy. Gonna miss me? Man, we're gonna end the chapter like this already. Shall we? Alright. There's nothing else anyway, so let's go. Yeah. Don Corneo. You should head back to Seventh Heaven. Meet up with the gang. But... I'll be fine. You've seen how much ass I can kick? I have. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Oh, no, you don't. You're going after her. She's a big girl. She can handle the likes of him. And worse. Uh-uh. You don't know, Corneo. It doesn't matter how strong or smart you think you are. He'll find a way to turn it against you. And where is she going to meet him? A mansion filled with his goons. Come on. Aren't you worried what might happen in there? You have to help her. <sighs> Okay. Well, we're back to the adventure once again. Check. Hey, Come welcome on, back, buddy. We gotta hurry. We're 150 meters away, so let's do this. Whoever gets good clapped up, we're ready to bust out our sword. Our reed's right behind us. Whatever the heck that is. Showgirls Paradise coming up. She's being sold off. What the heck? Chocobos! Wonder if we can ride them. Excuse me, partner. Hey there. Where are you headed? You gave a ride to a girl earlier. Do you have any idea where she went? No, and if you don't need a ride, then get the hell out of here. Can't you see I'm trying to work? Can't say I can, no. What'd you say to me, Yuzu? <laughs> What's all the ruckus out here? I don't know you. What's your story? We're looking for a girl who took one of your carriages. Can you help us find her? Depends. What do you want with this girl of yours? Guess. We want to save... Save her from a life without this handsome guy. Huh? So, that's how it is, huh? Well, I get a lot of customers. Hard to keep track of them all. This girl, what's she look like? Well... She's in great shape. Is that really important? Wait a minute. You talking about Tifa? That's her. <laughs> oh, looks like someone's got a bit of a crush. Hate to break your heart, kid, but it's gonna be a long while before she sees the light of day again. What do you mean? She's a real pretty girl. Corneo's hosting another audition, and Tifa was chosen as a candidate. An audition for what? For the title of the next Mrs. Corneo. She's what he likes all rolled into one sweet package. Having scouted girls for so long, I know his taste better than my own. And considering those tastes, I can guarantee you this. She won't be walking out of that mansion anytime soon. If at all. So where can we find this Don Corneo? <laughs> what are you asking for? Thinking of raising holy hell or something? Do what you gotta, but leave me out of it. I told you what you want to know. Now take a walk. 
Oh, and there goes our best lead yet. Maybe we'll have better luck in town. Let's check it out. To Corneo's mansion. Just look at dumps anyways. Is there anything? No? Okay. What the heck? Wall market. South Walmart. Welcome to Wall Market, the pleasure capital of Midgar that's got everything for everybody. Couple, huh? It's all good. Play together, do your own thing, earn a little scratch on the side even. Whatever you're into, we got you. Got a special one-time limited offer. No, thank you. Come on, Cloud. Let's go. All right. Welcome to Vegas. Midgar Vegas style. Hmm, are you more specific? No. Just more to explore and homeboy should be around the corner. Chadley. Oh. I will go wherever my research leads me, but the success of my endeavors rests entirely upon you. Your assistance would be much appreciated. What do we got for VR missions? Nope, okay, good. Cloud. I've come up with the most fascinating thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. I've registered a new summons. Back. I need you to defeat the summon entity so I can complete the attempt. I have to tell you that I'm grateful for all of your help. Best. Next. I've done it. I've developed a new material. Who's next? Fat Chocobo? Okay, we'll come back to another time with that. All of your future battle intel we're in the right direction, I, I guess. I don't know what that all about, but uh, the mansion. I think we might have found our man, and he's a gaudy one. Yeah. We're gonna knock out its front doors. Knock, knock. Not so fast, buddy. Back it up. Got no need for pretty boys here. We're looking for someone. Let me guess. First time in Walmart. Kid. Yeah? So? So people can't just walk through the dumb's front door. Especially men. How about me, then? Can I go inside? Maybe. But you're gonna wish you didn't. You know Leslie? She's kinda cute. Homely, but cute. Excuse you? Kinda cute's not gonna cut it. Come on, can't you help us out? Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into? Aerith. Seriously, Les, she's not half bad. With a little work, I bet she'd clean up real nice. Cloud, requesting permission to kill. Denied. <sighs> if you're really sure you want to join an audition, then you're going to need to get official approval. And who can give us that? The trio. The only ones in town who are considered authorities on Corneo's particular tastes. First, there's Chocobo Sam. And then there's Madame M over at the massage parlor. Last but not least, there's the Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea. They're an eccentric bunch, to put it mildly. And you should know they don't recommend just any girl stupid enough to come knocking. Hmm. Duly noted. Thanks for the info. We'll be back soon. Great. Now we have to do all those stuff. Gotcha. Let's go get that fact chocobo while we're at it. The trio, Sam, and Rodea. Gotcha. Oh well, more time to explore. Aerith, you sure about this? If you've got any better ideas. Not really. So that's the way it is. Hmm. Tifa's been invited into the Don's estate. Huh? But, to earn such a privilege, you must first win the approval of one of the trio. Right? Meaning, I now know what I must do to save her. Stay strong, Tifa! Help is on the way! Johnny's coming, baby! <laughs> Why are you here? Not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? Nope. After him! After this small intermission.